Hi, welcome back. I'm Dr. Amy Novotny and we're gonna be continuing with our daily life series. We've been focusing a lot lately on cleaning the house and some of the basic chores that can affect our body. We've looked at how to handle sweeping, vacuuming, broom, you know, using a broom, but now let's look at how to wipe or wash the windows. There's some important considerations for our back, our neck, and our shoulders when we're washing the windows or wiping them down. One of the things that I see often is as soon as we lift up the arms, our back arches more than it should be. And we get this really strong curvature in our back, and now our back does a lot of the work, but we really haven't used our shoulder blade, and all we've really done is lift up our shoulders into our ears. Now instead, if we allow our rib cage to stay in neutral and we have a gentle curvature in our low back, and we learn how to allow that shoulder blade to move, we can start washing the windows, wiping them down, we spray them, we wipe them down, and you can see now if I need to lift up, my shoulder blade moves to allow me to lift up. If I come down, the shoulder blade comes down, my elbow comes down as well, and it stops creating some impingement on the top of our shoulder. That's where I see a lot of people get into trouble, is when they lift up their arms, they jump up this way. They lift up their chest this way. They arch their back more and they lift up, which creates a lot of pressure in the joint, creates decreased space for our bones to move across and slide and glide against each other. And of course we get pain. So instead, what if we keep the rib cage down, keep our ribs in neutral, keep our back in neutral. There should be a slight curvature in our thoracic spine up here and a gentle one in our lower back. And so we can work on wiping and even as you do this, you, once you get practice, you can practice dropping your chest down, letting the pecs relax so that your shoulder muscles do the work and it becomes less stressful on your body. I can't tell you how much better it feels when you use the correct muscles. You don't have that impingement, you don't have the pain, you don't have the soreness and you're not debilitated for the next day. I hope that was helpful. If you have questions, please let me know. Reach out to me, amy at paberinstitute.com. Thanks and have a great week. Bye guys.